Like the video and subscribe to our channel right now and get one week of amazing luck. Earth is filled with thousands of different animal species. Some are good, some are bad and some are cute. However, today we're going to learn about the 12 cutest, fluffiest, most lovable, and adorable animals on Earth. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the video about 12 cute exotic animals you can own as pets. Number 12. Axolotls Axolotls are not just uncommon pets because so few people possess them. They are also exotic pets because they are aquatic salamanders. Salamanders are adorable, but an aquatic salamander is quite cool. These adorable creatures can be purchased in fish-only pet shops. First-time pet owners should consider getting an axolotl because they are simple to care for and won't cause trouble around the house. They are adorable animals that only exist in their tanks and have the bizarre ability to recover a missing limb. A tiny tank with fresh water and a powerful filter are all that the axolotl requires to be a vibrant addition to your house. Afterward, you must routinely change their water, clean their tank, and provide them with the proper food. Number 11. Millipedes The millipede is one of the creepy crawlies you may keep as a pet. These peaceful and placid critters don't require much to get by on a daily basis. Although millipedes are obviously not a pet for everyone, they are relatively simple to care for because they don't leave poop and urine all over the place and take up very little room. Having said that, millipedes require specific substrates and the proper quantity of heating and lighting components to maintain the ideal temperature and humidity. While you two are spending quality time together, larger species like this guy can crawl over you even if you might not be able to walk them on a leash. The most popular millipede species offered as pets are African millipedes, which can grow up to 12 inches long. Additionally, millipedes undoubtedly consume less than your cat or dog. Number 10. The Kinkajou Looking a bit like a monkey, Kinkajous are often mistakenly called primates. They do have many traits and features like those of primates. But Kinkajous are carnivores in the family Procyonidae, which includes raccoons, coatis, ringtails, and olingos. They are actually members of the raccoon family. The rich and famous aren't the only ones who find these animals adorable. Celebrities like Paris Hilton are known to keep kinkajous in sugar gliders. However, because kinkajous are nocturnal animals who enjoy getting into things and can be quite dirty, choosing to care for one is not a decision that should be made lightly. Number 9. The Capuchin Monkeys an adorable primate that frequently appears in movies and television is the capuchin monkey. It is well known for its little stature and lively, mischievous demeanor. Bear in mind the monkey from Pirates of the Caribbean and Jack Sparrow, they have a long lifespan of up to 40 years, are quite intelligent, and are territorial. Unless you could teach your monkey to use the bathroom, that would be 40 years of diapers. Number 8. The Serval. While most cat lovers would undoubtedly be content to settle for this wild beauty, we aren't all able to acquire a royal Bengal tiger as Mike Tyson once did. Servals may even be litter trained with enough time and effort. These medium-sized African cats are used to living in warm environments with lots of space. This tells you pet owners that your exotic cat will need a fair amount of space to feel at home. A large garden is definitely your best option because servals enjoy playing and need a lot of daily exercise. Number 7. The Chinchilla From gerbils to hamsters, rodents are known for being among the cutest house pets. But the chinchilla is on the more exotic end of the scale and is probably 10 times cuter. Although the South American chinchilla is one of the more destructive rodents, it can form a tight attachment with its caretaker. That doesn't mean they're harmful or anything, they just don't enjoy cuddling. You'll need more than a simple hamster wheel to keep these little guys entertained because they're rather active and get bored fairly rapidly. At least not nearly as much as they enjoy running around and playing. However, we're sure that you'll concur that the extra work was well worth it for those enormous ears and that fluffy tail. Number 6. The Crested Gecko. Despite preferring to eat crickets and mealworms, 
creepy creatures can nonetheless be somewhat adorable. The tiny hands and eyes of the crested gecko, which has a somewhat silly smile and tiny hands that you can see for yourself, are up to your interpretation. But the crested gecko is undoubtedly one of the cutest reptiles you can acquire. They are incredibly well-liked pets because of their low maintenance requirements and amusing dispositions. Crested geckos are wonderful pets for children and novice reptile owners since they require such little maintenance. Number 5. The Capybara. You might initially mistake this huge cuteness for a gigantic guinea pig, and you'd be right. One of the world's biggest rodents, the capybara from South America can weigh up to 140 pounds. Because capybaras are semi-aquatic rodents, you won't need a large cage, so cross that dog-sized hamster wheel off your shopping list. This animal will need access to a body of water, such as your pool, in order to swim around. Despite being very cute and cuddly, capybaras can be difficult to keep as pets, especially given that they are highly gregarious creatures. Therefore, if you intend to purchase one, it is best to create room for a few more. Although some nations and states may require a special license, owning this rodent is generally lawful. Those adorable, hairy snouts are more than worth the extra paperwork, though. Number 4. Box Turtles Box turtles, like most turtles, are attractive and make excellent long-term reptile friends, despite the fact that they can be difficult to care for. This species can live up to 50 years, which may sound like a long time for a house pet but is ludicrous next to Jonathan, the oldest turtle in the world at 189 years old. They carry their homes on their backs. Box turtles enjoy occasionally soaking in water to rehydrate and cool off, but since they are truly land turtles, this doesn't necessarily make them expert swimmers. A box turtle may make a rather cute addition to your terrarium despite having sharp beaks, rough scaly skin, and small pointed claws. They seem pretty clumsy doing it. Number 3. Fennec Fox These foxes are the tiniest breed of foxes in the world and originate from the African continent. Weighing in at only about 4 pounds when fully grown, those lovely ears are anything from small. The fennec fox might become your preferred four-legged friend if you've never quite decided if you're a cat or dog person. The simplest way to characterize this fox's behavior is as a cross between a dog and a cat. You can leave them alone at home for a few hours because they are typically independent and lively like cats and dogs. But what distinguishes them is that they don't really prefer dog or cat toys. With the exception of a few states, owning this exotic animal, which has a lifespan of up to 15 years, is permitted across most of America. However, if you're determined to possess one, you can always relocate to a different state. Number 2. The Hermit Crab Underwater crawlers definitely aren't the first thing that comes to mind when picturing a nice and cuddly pet, but there is one little creature that can make your aquarium just a little bit sweeter. Not only for its protruding eyes but also for its unique personality contrary to most crabs, permits have a smaller, softer abdomen, which they adorable protect by residing inside a shell of snail. The owners of these pets must offer progressively larger shells throughout the course of their lifetimes because they must continue to discover larger shells as they increase in size, establishing a highly unique link between caregiver and animal. Number 1. Sugar Glider Get a sugar glider if you've ever wanted to experience what it's like to own a flying squirrel. While it is not possible to domesticate squirrels, sugar gliders are the next best thing and, in the opinion of many, much cuter. Simply observing those eyes. Although they have a similar appearance, kangaroos and sugar gliders are both marsupials. The glider of the female serves as a pouch where she rears her young until they are able to fly away. I mean, just leave on their own. If you're wondering how they earned their name, it comes from their love of sweet foods, especially fresh fruit and vegetables. The finest thing about these residents of Australia is how much they enjoy having playdates with their guardians and how well they get along with other animals. <laughs>